Hi guys, it's 4 a.m. right now. Look at this, 401. And today we're gonna hunt cloud. This is Dalat at 4 a.m. and it's so peaceful. Today, I'm gonna go cloud hunting at Godut, which is 40 minutes away from the center of Dalat. The way to get there was a bit foggy since it's early morning and the road is quite rocky, but there were some signs and instructions there. Like the sun is rising and you see the cloud here usually people come here for like a couple of weeks and they hunt uh, the clouds but sometimes they don't have any luck you know but today we're so lucky that we can see the clouds right here right here wow. it's breathtaking it's really nice all right let's come closer i can see the moon up there too <laughs> The clouds look like a beautiful waterfall white stream hovering on the blue sky. They look so soft and fluffy just like cotton candies. This is one of the best views I've seen in my life. I don't think words can describe how magnificent it is. I think I'm falling in love with Dalat. Here I can see people lining up over there to take pictures with the cloud. But it's really, really beautiful. I think um, if you come to Dalat, wake up at 3 a.m. and try this because this is uh, the most try activity when you come here. After successfully hunting clouds, I decided to visit Dallas Last Railroad. It was built by the French in 1903 and it took nearly 30 years to finish. This 84 kilometers track frequently transported fresh fruits, vegetables, and flowers to the coast, shuttling tourists back in the other direction. It's somewhat romantic, yet mysterious at the same time. Another free location that you might want to check out. It's almost 9 o'clock now and I'm getting hungry, so I decided to eat a noodle dish called Mi Guang. I found this local place which is at 14A Yersin Street. By the way, Dr. Yersin was credited with finding the site for the new town of Dalat in 1893, so they named the street after him. This restaurant is known for the best Mi Guang in Dalat, and when you see a lot of locals eating here, you know the food is outstanding. Look at this mouth-watering dish. I can see they have shrimp, quail eggs, pork, and served with herbs and Vietnamese crackers. This one is, it kind of looks like crackers, uh, but in Vietnamese it's called bánh đa. So I'm gonna dip it in here and then try it. Mm. Mm. The dish is commonly served with a small amount of broth, which is generally infused with turmeric and is so tasty. So at first I thought the noodles would be like egg noodles, um, gonna be yellow noodles. But here, I feel like the noodle is similar to pho noodles. It's just thicker and wider. Uh, it's actually chewier. 
the broth is really good. Um, it's sweet and it's fishy, but it's not like too fishy. Dalat is known for beautiful pine trees and the city is the one place in Vietnam where you can experience all seasons in one day. Spring in the morning, summer at midday, fall in the evening and winter at night. The weather is perfect for anyone who is looking to escape the tropical heat of Vietnam. So I decided to go hiking around the Duyên Lâm Lake where I can also see the beautiful sunset there. What else is better than immersing myself in nature, smelling pine trees and enjoying the fresh air? I have to say Da Lat is one of my favorite cities in Vietnam. So at night, I went to a coffee shop called Tui Mơ To and if you're a type of person who loves cozy and cute coffee shops like me, this is a perfect spot for you. From the bird's eye view, you can see the lights from vegetable greenhouses and they look so beautiful and romantic. I have to say the view here is breathtaking. Look at this. This is so beautiful. The drink prices are pretty affordable, only 50,000 Viet Nam Dong, which is about $2 for a cup of coffee. They also have desserts and display many plants here. The only downside is that they don't have English in the menu, so you might have to ask for the drink that you want. Other than that, everything was pretty good. I really like this spot and definitely come back here again, but it's getting late now, so I'm gonna go home and prepare for another fun day in Dalat. In the next video, I'll visit Dalanta Waterfall and I'll show you where to eat the best local food in Dalat. So don't forget to subscribe to see more. Good night everyone and I'll see you soon. Bye!